What's poppin'? It's your boy Cash Gouve. I'm here with man Jay from Game Six. What's poppin', Jay? Man, I'm just grateful to be here, man. We've been crushing it, having a blast, man. But I want to say thank you for being the GOAT, the pioneer to this whole crypto Web3 game, man. You've changed my business. You've changed my platform. You've changed the game for us, man. So we appreciate you, brother, man. Oh, man, I'm, I'm glad to hear it. I appreciate you telling me. And I wanted to have you on because you told me about how you leveraged the video that I created showing you how to mint an NFT on OpenSea on Polygon and how you applied that to your own current business, which is a you're basically selling game picks, but also giving advice about how to manage your bankroll. Absolutely, man. And dude, like your video was it was so simple that it was so easy to duplicate. Right on. And so what you guys don't know what he's talking about is the NFT is his picks, but you can do unlockable content. And that's what he he figured that part out on his own. It wasn't even really in the video much. So I just maybe mentioned it. I can't even remember if I did or not. But basically, we're going to go over now the other side of that. So now this video is very important because I'm going to show you now how to buy an NFT on OpenSea that's on the Polygon network. This is just as important as trying to sell it. And the reason why it matters is because I'm going to show you how to buy an NFT on the Polygon network without having to spend all the gas fees of transferring your Ethereum from the Ethereum network over to the Polygon network. So let's get into it. Okay, so Jay, here we are on your page on OpenSea. Right here is your pick. So we, we click on this. So you see it says here, include unlockable content. So basically, I have to buy it. I've already got Ethereum in my Polygon wallet right here. If I did not have Ethereum already in my Polygon wallet, I wouldn't be able to buy this. And OpenSea would ask me if I wanted to bridge it over. And the last time we tried to do it, it cost $70 in gas fees. He's only selling his pick for a couple of dollars. That obviously doesn't make sense. I'm going to show you a quick video of how to get Ethereum into your Polygon wallet into OpenSea. And that's by withdrawing it from Crypto.com. Crypto.com is only on your phone. It's only as a phone app. So I've already got some Ethereum in the balance. I hit transfer. You hit withdraw. External wallet. Now you are going to click the plus at the top right to create a wallet for your whitelist. Wallet address. You're putting your wallet address here. But first, select network. And this is the key. Come all the way over to Polygon. And now it says ETH wallet address. And it says it's Polygon. And you'll input it right here. After you put in your address to be whitelisted, it takes 24 hours before they allow you to withdraw. After the 24 hours, you come back, you'll transfer, withdraw, external wallet. It's right there, my MetaMask Polygon wallet, and I hit withdraw. You put in the amount of money you want to withdraw, and then hit withdraw, and it'll show up in your MetaMask wallet, but underneath your Polygon network. So now that we've got the Ethereum in the Polygon wallet right here, now I can buy Jay's pick. So here we go. And go buy now. Selling for $3.51. You always got to sign it. And you sign it by way of your wallet. Okay, now you can see on my page that I own his NFT right here. So I can go to reveal the unlockable content. Click this. And now I've got his picks. All right, so it was that easy. Now I own your NFT. And I hit the unlockable content and I can see the picks. Absolutely, man. And as you saw from like the last week, you know, playoff ticket right there, it was not just valuable, but it was also profitable. And man, I'm, I'm, I appreciate you saying that, but the key really is to save money for your customers, right? We don't want everybody yeah. to blow their money on gas fees. So by putting your Ethereum in crypto.com and then withdrawing it on the Polygon network, I only, they only charge me like a dollar. I don't have to pay the $70 in gas fees to get some mm -hmm. Ethereum into my Polygon wallet. And that's what's really valuable for everyone out there to know who's trying to sell NFTs on Polygon. It's great that you can mint them for free, but you want your fans and your customers to be able to purchase them for next to nothing as well. Exactly, exactly. And, and, and that's why we have our tickets at the price that they're at. So it says like like we're we're not trying to necessarily make money off of the end user that way. We actually want to make money with the end user. So like this is just a way that we can do it with the NFT metaverse 
Web3 space, and, you know, we're having a ball doing it, man. This is just the beginning. Right on, Jay. Well, thanks for coming on, man. And I'm glad you found value in the video, and I appreciate you telling everybody about it, and we're going to keep pushing for it. Appreciate you, brother, man. Thank you for the opportunity, man. Everybody have a great evening. For sure. And good luck, man, on these games this weekend, too. Thank you, bro. Let's go. Peace. You missed a good one if you wasn't there. Taking over the game, man. NFTs, all that. That's how we get it, man. Artists taking it back for ourselves.